terms of bringing hope, I mean, there's absolutely no question about the hope that is brought through this project, both in the urgent need that is sometimes there for food, um, but also in, um, in, in, in other ways where um, support is given to people who have difficulties in claiming benefits, who have problems in that whole system, um, who need to be um, supported through so that they don't fall foul of a system which is going eventually to hurt them rather than benefit them. Um, and all of that the, um, the food bank is now doing in terms of um, benefits, support, um, welfare rights, advocates, um, all of those things are important important in being able to help people to uh, sustain themselves in what are difficult times. Well, I think when somebody comes through the door, um, uh, a lot of people we meet are deeply, deeply ashamed to have to ask for help. And having to ask for food is absolutely shocking in this day and age. So that hope that people get when they come in here to know actually it might be okay. With the help of the food bank, you know, we might just get through this. Well, Mandel's has, has helped grow and bring hope. Um, we've worked very closely with Community Action Northumberland and we have been um, support people for anybody in need. If they come, it's a visiting, a drop-in place. So if they've got any issues or concerns, they share it with the volunteers. So we can work and that's covering all their age groups. The bringing hope stuff for me is very much about addressing things like loneliness on our estate. There's a massive amount of older people who are widowed or have never married, who are single and we see them out and about shopping. It's an opportunity for a smile and a little word and again an invitation. And just letting people know that church is here for them.